Jeff Sloan here, editor of Composites World. We're at uh, JEC World 2018 for day two of the big show. It was a uh, monumentally busy day at the show, as maybe you can tell by my scratchy voice and uh, harried appearance. Most of the news today was in automotive. Uh, we learned today that German composites fabricator Voith has uh, manufactured the carbon fiber rear wall for the Audi R A8 and that uh, it's using a Zoltec 50K car, uh, carbon fiber with a snap cure resin, epoxy resin, and it's made via high pressure RTM. Uh, Voigt says it uh, makes these parts in about five minute cycles, and it's making 65,000 parts per year using this material and process. Continental Structural Plastics, based in the United States, confirmed that it is indeed making the carbon fiber bed for the new G, the 2019 GM pickup truck, the Sierra pickup truck. Uh, it confirmed that this is a uh, carbon fiber with a nylon resin. Uh, Continental Structural Plastics would not confirm the process that's used, but we do know that from uh, past reports that General Motors has been uh, working with uh, Continental Structural Plastics to develop Continental Structural Plastics Cerebro process. This is S-E-R-R-E-E-B-O. It's a process that uses compression molding with carbon fiber and nylon. And finally, Roth Composites Machinery reported to us today that it is now making high pressure hydrogen composite storage vessels using the high speed filament winding process. Uh, the vessels, Roth says, can be uh, wound in just 30 minutes, and this is uh, compared to the previous process, which took about two hours to wind the vessels. And that's all for today. Check back tomorrow for a report on day three from JEC World 2018. Again, this is Jeff Sloan, editor of Composites World, reporting from Paris at uh, JEC 2018. Have a good day.